What if I told you that you can install a PK files directly on Windows? No Bluestacks, no Knox, no emulator at all? In this video, I'll show you a clean, fast, and native way to run Android apps on Windows like real desktop apps. Android emulators are slow, heavy, and full of ads. But in 2026, you don't need them anymore. All right, let's dive into it. So first, let's talk about the tool we're going to use. There is a tool called WSA Manager. Open the Microsoft Store on your Windows. In the search bar, type WSA Manager with a PK installer. Make sure you select the correct app. Once you find it, click Install and wait until the download is finished. Alternatively, if you don't want to search manually, you can check the link in the video description. I've already included the official Microsoft Store link there. In the latest version, you don't need to download or search for any extra packages. Everything is already included in one single download. Unlike older methods like Pac-Man, you don't need to install a DB separately, you don't need to search for Android platform tools and more. So this makes the process much simpler and beginner-friendly. After the installation is complete, open WSA Manager and we're ready to move on to the next step. Go to the Status Manager section. Here you'll see some options marked as attention required. This is normal. First, click Start WSA. If WSA does not start, don't worry, you just need to enable a Windows feature. Click the Windows search bar. Search for Turn Windows Features On or Off. Open it. Find Virtual Machine Platform. Enable it and click OK. Restart your PC if Windows asks you to. After reboot, go back to WSA Manager. Now click Install WSA and wait for the download to finish. Once it's installed, click Start WSA again. Next, we need to enable a DB. Click Start a DB. If a DB does not start, go to Settings inside WSA Manager. Then click Download a DB. If you prefer, I'll also put the ADB package link in the video description so you can download it manually. Once a DB is downloaded, go back to Status Manager and click Start a DB again. Now for the last step, click Connect Double USA to a DB. If this is your first time, Double USA Manager will show you a short guide, just follow it. Click Open Double USA Settings. Go to Advanced Settings and enable Developer Mode. Once Developer Mode is enabled, go back to Double USA Manager. Now click Connect Double USA to a DB again. If a prompt appears asking, just click Allow. Once connected, you'll see that all attention required warnings are gone. That means everything is set up correctly. You can now install a PK files directly on your Windows computer. Now everything is set up. You can now install a PK files directly on Windows. There are two easy ways to do it using Double USA Manager. You can simply double-click the APK file and Double USA Manager will automatically install it for you. Or open Double USA Manager and click the Install a PK button. Then browse and find the APK file you want to install. Select it and open. In my case, I want to install Delta Executor and run it on my computer. Double USA Manager will start installing the app automatically. After installation is complete, the app will appear in your start menu and you can run it just like a normal Windows application. That's it, no emulator, no command line, and no complicated steps. So as you can see, installing a PK files on Windows in 2026 is now easier than ever. With Double USA Manager you can run Android apps directly on Windows, faster, cleaner, and closer to a native experience. If this video helped you, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one.